the clearing control over your life, my inner peace comes first, and to find that peace I will examine my life and my thinking daily, to control the power and restlessness of the rational mind, and to find and take in the positive energies that support my awareness and inner peace. I will examine my life daily to free myself of any single thing that keeps me from complete self-acceptance and reasonable acceptance and compassion for others. In my daily examination, I will find behaviors in my life that are negative energies that force me to control feeling within myself and interfere with my peace of mind because my inner peace comes first. In my daily examination, I will seek the truth and in that, I will recognize negative energies because they lie and to remain active within me, they create illusions of truth. I am not a pre-programmed machine. I am responsible for my own well-being and positive outlook, and in that, I will always be open to every chance, even if it is painful to me, that offers me the opportunity to become more aware of negative energies within me. The good Lord has provided me with everything I need to be happy and to enjoy the very second of every experience of the here and now. I will not allow the past nor a future that isn't here yet or demands and expectations of others to take that heavenly gift away from me. I am responsible for my here and now. I am responsible for everything that I experience because I have decided what my actions will be, what will influence me, and how I will interact with others. I must be responsible for myself in order to grow daily into a higher consciousness. Although I will strive to have acceptance and compassion for others, that acceptance and compassion must be tempered by reason. I will not allow myself to become entangled in their dilemmas and dramas. I will always interact with others from a position of wisdom, love, and expanded consciousness that comes from being a centered cognizant human being. I will not interact with others when I am upset or emotionally drained. I will understand that everyone, everyone, is a human being in the making searching in their own way for their God-given right to higher consciousness. And I will remember to laugh because it's good for me.